want to learn how to make this t-shirt without weaving vinyl? Stay tuned! Today I'm going to use sublimation transfer paper from TechRap Craft and I am going to make my design on Illustrator. I really think that we can make this design on Canva. Um, it's just that this is a tool I have in hand and that's the reason I'm using Illustrator. But I know not everyone has Illustrator, but I think everyone has access to Canva. And we can try on a future video to make a design on Canva. Once I have the size of the rectangle and I adjust it the chosen, I am going to add another rectangle on top of that one. And that way I am going to create the lines around the chosen. What I'm going to do is that I'm going to change the color of the rectangle that is on the front to white and now I created the lines around the chosen. Now I am going to offset my the word chosen and change the color to white. Once we finish our design, we just have to print it on our sublimation transfer paper. Remember that we need a sublimation printer. There are a ton of printers out there and a lot of brands and the prices ranges from 400 to thousands of dollars. I have a regular printer. I have an Eco, an Epson, I'm sorry, Epson EcoTank 
and that's what I use. I have been using from last year and it works really well. I'm going to use a Bella, Bella canvas. Um, they are 45% polyester. I marked the center of the t-shirt and then I went over it with my heat press i pressed it for 15 seconds on 350 after doing that our t-shirt is ready We are almost done and this is how it looks and I love it. What I love the most about sublimation is how that design feels um, when you wear it and when you touch it. It's like it's part of the fabric. So friends, this is all for today. I hope you liked the, the video. Please subscribe to this channel. Give us a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching. This was Arlene. Have a great day.